Now here is the situation. This is our wall and this is the person who's walking away from the wall, the person who's whistling and he's walking uh, with a speed of one meters per second. And we know that if he's walking, then the wave fronts would be closer, closely packed over here and they will be far apart behind the source. He's the source, right? And he's walking towards this, this boy, this uh, boy, which I'm representing by O, okay? Yeah, he'll hear four beats per second because he is receiving the frequency directly from the, the person who is walking, the whistler, as well as the frequency which is reflecting from the wall and coming back to this observer O. Okay? So we just have to find what those frequencies are, take their difference and that will be equal to 4. So the situation is equivalent to two sources producing beats. First is the whistle of the boy and the other is the reflection from the wall. So F1 will be equal to, as the source is moving, you know the formula V upon V minus Vs, the frequency would be increased, times the original frequency F, so 340 upon 340 minus 1 into F. F2 will be the frequency which is over here, that will be V upon V plus Vs into F, because the source, you know, from that side is moving away. Into the original frequency which is F, that makes 340 upon 340 plus 1 into F, right? So FB becomes, the beat frequency which is equal to f1 minus f2 so that is 340 by 339 f minus 340 upon 341 f so that makes the original frequency equal to 680 hertz for more videos and live lectures on the jee click on the subscribe button now